are we doing it. today? Good. Where are we going? To Disney. To Disney. We flew in yesterday. We had a long, not a long flight. We flew to Texas. Until we meet again. Take care, Houston. I'm out. Peace. Then we had a five hour layover. taking us to Disney this weekend and then we're going on a cruise next week so we're just getting a quick bite of eat they're all up there ordering and we're just gonna get something to eat before we go to Disney aren't we yeah are you excited yeah all right I'm excited too all right are we gonna have a fun day yeah okay yeah
Hey, good job, great. Mickey and Minnie. He can't go and take it. He said, "I'm gonna wear, I'm gonna wear some for him." You got a ticket? He came and got a ticket. Yeah. Look at his face, dude. Let her get a picture with Mickey and Minnie. Put him up. had such a fun day yesterday at Animal Kingdom and today we're having kind of an off day we're just chilling we've been relaxing all day me and Sean got our COVID test this morning for the cruise they were both negative yay <laughs> and um, yeah we're just uh, it's like 6 30 in the evening 7 and uh, down from uh, Sean's brother's house is a park, so I brought Harrison down to the park to play because he's really not had any activity today. He's just been lounging around and on his iPad. So, um, just been relaxing today and uh, so I'm letting Harrison run out some energy with the kids. He loves the parks, he loves kids. And then we're going to go back and have some grilled hot dogs and uh, just enjoy family time tonight and then tomorrow. We are going to Hollywood Studios, our second Disney park. Thank you to Uncle Seth and Aunt Rachel. And uh, yeah, it'll be a great day. So I'm still waiting for Harrison's test because he had to have a PCR test for the ship since he's unvaccinated. And uh, so that we should get that tomorrow. But me and Sean were negative, so I'm sure he will be too. And uh, then we'll have everything we need for the cruise. So we're excited. So we're just going to let Harrison play.
introduction. Well, nothing's too good for my best buddy. I pulled out all the stuff. Lights, lasers, and smoke. There's no smoke. No smoke! <coughs> Thanks, Mater. <coughs> Hello, everyone. Wow, what a great group of rookie racers. You know, I only figured out how to be a great racer because I had a great teacher, Doc Hudson. That's why I started this racing academy, so I could pay that forward to all of you. Uh, buddy? Yes, Mater? Doc wasn't the only one that taught you a thing or three. <laughs> That's right. He taught me how to drive backwards, how to tip tractors, how to be a great friend. Yeah, and then he went on to win a heap of piston cups. <laughs> now, winning is great and all, but Doc taught me at the end of the day, without your friends, it's just an empty cup. Is that true? Doc's passion for racing was inspiring. If he couldn't outrace them, he would outthink them. Ladies and gentlemen, cars, they're fabulous Hudson Hornet. Wow. Now, to kick off today's lesson, I'm going to take a few laps on a simulator. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Simulators and I don't get along very well. Uh, did you have to show that, Mater? What well, it makes you more dramatic. Yeah, but that's not going to happen this time, thanks to the tech-savvy rookie sensation and my friend, Cruz Ramirez! Hello, everybody! After today, you'll be ready to meet it, greet it, and defeat it! Exactly! Mater, boot up the simulator! You got it! What? Oh, oh gotta push the button. <laughs> As you get started, get used to the speed for a moment and pick a line and stick to it. Uh-oh, congestion ahead. What should we do, Cruz? Imagine a stampede and hit a window. Just like Spooky taught us. Thank you. 